One of the many things that I use to help reduce fibromyalgia pain are resistance tubes. Of course, this helps you reduce the pain in your arms. If you watch my video on fibromyalgia, you'll see that I could barely use my arms. I almost had to retire on disability retirement at a pretty young age. And I did many, many different things you'll see in many of my different videos to help me manage the pain and gain my ability back to the point to where I don't feel like I have fibromyalgia anymore. Praise God for that. I do believe that a lot of that had to do with God's healing as well. But um, did want to talk about this. This is a good tool whether you have fibromyalgia or not. It's also a good tool if you work on the mouse and keyboard all day. One thing I like about the, the uh, tube is that it actually helps you to exercise the muscles in your back, which get neglected a lot, but that is so essential to avoid pain in your shoulders and arms caused by fibromyalgia or overuse. So um, this is actually a level one. It, I, I, you'll see from my videos, I normally get the lowest or next to the lowest levels of many things regarding resistance because with fibromyalgia, you're so sensitive and you don't need high resistance in order to manage fibromyalgia pain. What you need is movement, but you need a little bit of resistance. So highly, highly recommend this. This is actually the Reebok brand. And I like how handles are movable. You can rotate them and do a lot of different exercises with them. I'm not gonna do any demonstrations of exercises that I do. Please go to a trained physical therapist for that. But actually, I had a physical therapist in the past that required that I buy this in order to do the exercises they gave me to do at home because when you go to physical therapy, they give you homework. And so some physical therapy places or programs that you're in to get the treatment might pay for this for you. Mine unfortunately didn't. It's not real expensive though, and this will last a long time. This is something definitely worth getting to get your movement and resistance going with fibromyalgia. You do wanna build your muscles with uh, fibromyalgia. I'm not a bodybuilder channel by a long shot. You'll have to go to another channel for that. But if you're building your muscles, that will actually help you reduce fibromyalgia pain, get those muscles firing correctly, and get the right muscles used for the right activities, which is an issue with fibromyalgia. Sometimes the wrong muscles are firing off and you're using the wrong muscles for the wrong things. So strengthening yourself is gonna be a big thing to help you maintain that, to get the pain level down as much as possible and to get your ability and range of motion back. Movement is a really important thing with fibromyalgia because if you're like me and you're stuck in one position for a long time, you'll get something called frozen body, kind of taken from the term frozen shoulder, but I get it all over my body. If I'm sitting in a position for too long of a time, and this doesn't even happen to me anymore, but this was when my fibromyalgia was really bad, I'll notice that when I do move, I'm really stiff, I'm really, I'm going through a lot of pain, the range of motion is really lacking, and the disability sets in, and it is not fun. So finding the right balance of movement and rest is gonna be really important for you to manage your fibromyalgia. I can't tell you what that is because it's different for every person. You're gonna have to go through trial and error to find out and I hope that you find the right balance with that so that you can live the life that God created you for, which is an able-bodied life to fulfill his will. Nothing wrong with being disabled, absolutely. I mean, I still consider myself disabled with what I went through with fibromyalgia. And you can also do a lot of good for God being disabled. But if there is a way that you can gain your ability back, I can imagine that you would want to try that because being disabled in this society is extremely, extremely hard. And I pray that um, God heals you from whatever you're going through, whatever ailment, whatever, anything in your life. I, I pray for God's best for you and God's peace and that uh, you live a pain-free life doing the things you love. God bless.